Hello everybody, if you click on this video, you here because you, you want to know how to set up Mar for 3 Plutonium on Plutonium and where to get the the game for free. If you if you own the game for free, I mean if you own the game on Steam, then I have a link down below I have the, to have the, the easier way to, to set it up if you own the game on Steam. But if you don't own the game, then this is the right guide for you. Uh, so first off, uh, you wanna, you wanna go to your Steam, don't worry, we're not gonna buy the game, and, uh, you, you just saw where it was, but, so home page, right, store, store, store page, you go to your library, home, and for you, I'm just un uncheck this, for you, it's gonna say games and software below home, so go down, put a check mark on tools, and then you go down where it says call the more for 3 day case server and you want to install this and download this now before you do that uh, I want to I want you to go over here to the settings icon is manage thing and go to properties general and where it says languages Put it as a preferred language because for some reason this is on default is gonna say for all uh for all languages. If you leave it like that for all for all languages, the game will not open up on on Plutonium. So make sure. So mine is English, others could be some other um other language, but for me it's English. Once that is done, then yeah, install and download this. And total is going to be 14 gigabytes, and there's only the multiplayer side only. If you want to play the campaign and the spec apps, I'll I'll get into that uh, later later on in, in this video. Now, once that is done downloading, do not launch it here. Launch it on Plutonium. Now, if you want to download the DLC maps, then I have the a link down below of that file uh, and you should see this so uh, before you double tap this to download this this is the easiest way right click on this downloads and then standard download that's going to extract the file and zip the file now if it does not does that when it's done downloading if it does not extract fire the file for you then just extract it yourself uh now the when when it's done downloading and, and you extracted the files drag it to your desktop okay so for example mine's going to be this my wallpaper which is not and uh for you it's going to say a different name which is the file of the name which is uh marvel 3 D dlc Right, um, so drag it to your desktop. Now you want to, once you drag it to your desktop, put it on, on your on your desktop. You have to look for the Monster Three Day Case Server Steam. The file of that game on Steam. So to order to do that, go back to Steam. Go to Call the Monster Three Day Case Server where I showed you earlier in this video, and go to the setting manage icon go to properties browse local file and yep right here when was that and just drag it over here just like that do not drag it to any of these files just just drag it like on top of the first file just drag it in there and that's it you got the dlc now now that that part of the th that part of the video is done to get the game. Um, now I go to pl Plutonium, so I'm gonna show you how to set up on pl on Plutonium. Uh, Plutonium. And the first thing you're gonna see here, more for three multiplayer. It's for you gonna say setup. For me, it says play because I already set up already. But for here, it's a little complicated. 
depends in, it depends on your files on PC on yours but I don't know if it's the same for all so I want you to, I want you to click setup for me to play because I already you know set it up already and uh, I'm just go to it and you gotta look for Steam so go to lo so go to your local disk. No, sorry, not not local disk. Go to this PC. Uh, look, local disk. There you go. And go down where it says program files times eighty six. So it could be some other number. And uh, just go down until you see Steam. And once that is done, go to Steam Maps, and go to Common. And there you go, Call of, Duty Modern, Modern, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Just highlight that and you just just press uh, just press select folder. Since I already did mine already, I don't need to do that. Uh, and after that, you're done. It's gonna say play. And as you as you know, I'm not I'm not gonna get into the game. <laughs> Um, let's first gonna say play. Just click on play, and you got the game. Now, if you if you if you're waiting for how to play the spec ops in the campaign, then I have a link down below of this uh, launcher file for that part. Uh, it's gonna download the spec ops in the campaign separately. It's not gonna download, it's not gonna download the multiplayer part. Uh, so to so I have a link down below uh, of that one. It's called Altaware. So just download that. Uh, and I don't, I don't know if you need to extract it. Try, try it. I forgot if I need to extract it. But I don't think so. Just, just download it. If you need to extract it, extract it. Then I want you to drag that file to desktop one, once more. So printing this is my file. It's gonna say Alienware E E E X E or E X A. So now I need you to go find the the Steam profile of the game again. And this time the easiest way you could do it is just go to Steam. Call the one for the your servers. And just browse look file and Boom, there you go. And I just drag it in here. And then you go here. Alien onto where launcher. And for you it's gonna be different because I already I already did this already. But it's gonna start uh yep, there you go. I already did my already, but for you it's just gonna say uh, updating existing files or downloading files that are needed. Wait, wait for that. Wait for that to like uh, to uh, download, and and once that is done, it's just gonna launch. It's just it's just gonna launch it itself. Oops. Uh, once that is done, it's gonna launch it, or you're gonna have this this screen right here. Just click single player. And my recording might be kind of laggy. Just press allow. Because, uh, you know. Where is it? Here you go. And there you have it. You have, uh, all warfare is based. You have the game. No, I'm not be offended. Yes, I'm asking it again. And there you go. Spec out the campaign. Just make sure to check your settings. And that's it. I'll quit out of this. Well, there you go. 
just uh, if you want to play the campaign uh, spec ops right here alienware launcher and if we just if we just want to play the the multiplayer side then just go to plutonium just i'm going to show you plutonium play There you go, and just go to your uh, options to uh, to make sure your video settings is good and clear. And that is all for today. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this. Um, enjoy this. I, ho I hope this uh, it's helpful for the ones who who's trying to uh, download one for three on Plutonium, getting the free copy of the file. And also uh, the spec of the campaign. Uh, if you have any trouble, just comment down below and I'll be happy to answer the uh, best of my knowledge. Uh, yep, thank you so much. And so subscribe if you enjoy. And if you don't, don't give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs down if I didn't make myself clear. I don't really care. I just make this video just to help people want to play Modern 3 Plutonium and get the free copy of the game. Thank you and have a nice day.